believe the Chesapeake Bay Foundation is out about two miles offshore of Chesapeake Beach, Maryland, deploying 76 concrete reef balls, which have been set with oyster spat. Uh, this project is in collaboration with the Coastal Conservation Association of Maryland and the Maryland Department of Natural Resources. These reef balls will be providing uh, habitat for fish and are actually located in an oyster sanctuary and fish haven area. So the point of today's reef balls is to bring back oysters in the Chesapeake Bay, but also to provide fish habitat and opportunities for recreational anglers. We're planting 78 reef balls in total today, 76 which have just been set with oyster spat and a couple of older reef balls which are from previous projects and have oysters that are about five years old. We produced uh, these reef balls at our Shadyside Oyster Restoration Center in Shadyside, Maryland. We put them into tanks and introduced free swimming oyster larvae which landed and settled on these reef balls. And then we loaded them up onto our restoration vessel, the Patricia Campbell, and steamed down here to Chesapeake Beach to deploy. Reef balls are a great restoration technique because they provide instant oyster reef habitat in addition to fish habitat. Uh, as these reefs develop over time, the oysters will continue to grow. They will continue to filter water and the reef habitat that's provided by the reef balls themselves will continue to attract fish as well as increase their productivity.